Downtown Skycam, it's a it's a beautiful night. I mean, it's a summertime night out there, but we got a uh, plenty of moisture uh, in the air, so it's a muggy one, but 79 degrees, not too bad. Winds out of the southeast at eight miles an hour. This is what it looks like early on. 70s give way to 80s, but look at your lunch break. The feels like temperature 95 and those heat indices in the afternoon probably creep into the triple digits. It was a beautiful Iowa sunset. Hope you had a chance to enjoy this down in Sheraton. High today, 87, the average 86. The record, 2012, 105. Kind of unusual. Most records this time of year are either from 34 or 1936. 52 in 1887, the severe drought. It is over in southwestern Story County, northwestern Polk County, much of Dallas County, Jefferson, Coon Rapids, Guthrie Center. It drops south of I-80, moves to the north up and through west, uh, western uh, Webster County. You can see that area in tan. That is a moderate drought area in yellow is abnormally dry. Look to the east above normal rainfall. I-35 corridor about one to two below. And then the area where you have the severe drought four to 11 inches below normal for the year. Few clouds are drifting through right now. The closest storm is over west of McCook, Nebraska, spinning over that way. Overall, it's pretty quiet. Lots of heat tomorrow. 90s, Minneapolis, 92, Kansas City, 92, St. Louis, sunshine and cooler, Chicago and Detroit. Here we go, hour by hour, sunshine tomorrow. I think in the afternoon, a few clouds will try to bubble on up. Hour by hour to pick a shower, not a great chance of that at all. Saturday morning, storms cruise by up in Minnesota. Heat, humidity on Saturday. It is Sunday. We'll get some storms early in the morning hour. This may come together and form a line. If it does not, we'll get storms firing up in the afternoon. And they could be persistent, potentially right through Monday morning. Town to town, it's heat names tomorrow, 92. Winter set, that heat index will probably push near 100. A little bit of a breeze blowing through Bedford. Guthrie Center, 94. High in Algona, 91. Look for mostly sunny skies in Sac City. Temperatures in Webster City, 91. Toledo, you'll be busting up to near 90. And 90 in Albia and Corden, also mostly sunny there with a south to southeast wind. Tonight down to 70, mostly clear. Let's call it mild, just three degrees below the average. Uh, above the average sunset tomorrow, 840, 93. Again, that heat index pushing near 100 degrees. Feels like temperatures early on, 70s and 80s. It's going to be hotter the farther west and northwest you are. You can see that lunch break mid 90s out there and by later in the afternoon near 100, if not above, especially as you head to northwestern Iowa. Eight day forecast, 90s Saturday. Sunday will hit the 90s if we don't get that morning rain. If we do, it may suppress that temperature, but it really does look like a good chance of rain, and I know we need it Sunday and the Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, 80s, and then another chance of rain to finish your eight day.